Happening now, a shakeup affecting Arizona's political landscape. Phoenix Mayor Greg Stanton will say goodbye to his current post in a bid for Congress. Stanton has become known for his criticism of President Trump. He says Washington just isn't getting the job done. There are many miles between Phoenix and Washington, D.C., but what separates us most is how we work to solve problems. He is running for the District 9 seat currently held by Kirsten Sinema, who's leaving to challenge Senator Jeff Flake. Stanton is allowed to stay on as mayor until he submits his election petitions, and those aren't due until May of next year. Stanton's departure opens the door for a new spot at the top and possibly the city's first Latino mayor. Phoenix City Councilman Daniel Valenzuela throwing his hat in the ring. Valenzuela told me he wants to focus on economic development, but he may take a different path when it comes to a new arena for the Phoenix Suns and Coyotes downtown. We are in no position to build a new arena. Uh, the days, I think, of municipalities building new arenas or sports stadiums, uh, those days are over, and they're over here in Phoenix anyway. Last year, Mayor Stanton proposed a taxpayer-funded arena for both teams. Valenzuela wants the franchises to pay at least a portion of the cost. The District 5 councilman was first elected in 2011. He's been a Glendale firefighter for 14 years, and we just posted the entire interview on ABC15.com.